Still, there's a lot of battles in that front line, though. I was watching the defensive line that time play. Texas may be banged up. We talked about all the injuries that they have, the players playing out of position. But you know, this stadium right here has a lot of memories, a lot of feelings, and they want to play well. And it's got such a tradition of them playing well here. They don't want to lose. Let's go. Pressure from the blind side. He's hit the the pass to Ricky Stone. It'll be short of the first down by about four yards. Boy, Rasco was leveled from the blind side by Thomas Aldridge. Now, this is a tight end delay. Watch Stone. He's going to be in the top of your screen. He blocks, lets the secondary get off. Now he slips off the line, and you can see how wide open he is. He doesn't have great foot speed to go downfield and break tackles, but he has great hands. We saw that last week. He made some catches last week that were just unbelievable catches. Fourth down and four. Wow. Lee Newman is on to attempt a 54-yarder. Yesterday in practice, Dave, I was sitting up here watching him, and Newman was hitting him from 57 yards out with a little room to spare. So Jim Wacker wants to think it over. Newman cuts to the far sideline, 7.23 to play here at Memorial Stadium. It's the Longhorns by a touchdown. Inning in the first half. Bill, that's a dangerous field goal from 54 yards because the trajectory of the ball has to be so low to get the distance that sometimes they're easily blocked. Just an inadvertent hand sticking up and can block it. TCU's longest ever, a 56-yarder by Steve Mormon. This will be the second longest. Boy, Newman's got plenty of foot, and it is wide right. He had loads of distance. Boy, he did. He showed me something on that kick. That ball could have made probably close to 60 yards. It had that much height going across the ball, uh, going across the line. Well, thus far, the storyline in this ball game with 7-17 to play in the first half. TCU, it is Tony Jeffries, 77 yards rushing, but the Horn Frogs have given the ball to the Longhorns twice. Once via the fumble and once on an interception. First down, Texas. The pitch to the near side. Here comes Metcalf. Turns the corner. Oh, man, is he nailed. Somebody grabbed him by the base of the helmet, it appeared. Eric jumps right up. I believe it was Floyd Terrell. Watch this hit on the, on the sideline. You're going to see what it's like. He comes around here just as he turns out. You're going to see.